From our side, our uh, doors are open for negotiations. So we hope the other side also rethink their... Taliban tell Trump the doors are open. The Taliban have told the BBC that their doors are open should US President Donald Trump want to resume peace talks in the future. Chief Negotiator Sher Mohammed Abastanazai insisted negotiation remained the only way for peace in Afghanistan during an exclusive interview. Mr. Stanazai's words came a week after Mr. Trump declared the talks dead. Earlier this month, the two sides had appeared close to a deal to end the 18-year conflict. Mr. Trump had even invited Sar Taliban leaders and Afghan President Ashraf Ghani to meet at Camp David on 8 September. But a Taliban attack in the Afghan capital Kabul on 6 September, which killed a U.S. soldier and 11 others, prompted Mr. Trump to pull out, saying the group probably don't have the power to negotiate if they were unable to agree to a ceasefire during talks. Late on Tuesday, U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo issued a statement condemning recent Taliban attacks, saying the group must begin to demonstrate a genuine commitment to peace. Mr. Stanazai dismissed American concerns, telling the BBC the Taliban had done nothing wrong. They killed thousands of Talibans according to them, he told the BBC's chief international correspondent, Lies Doucet. But in the meantime, if one U.S. soldier has been killed that doesn't mean they should show that reaction because there is no ceasefire from both sides. From our side, our doors are open for negotiations, he added. So we hope the other side also rethink their decision regarding the negotiation.